okay guys welcome back to my wordpress tutorial today i'll be showing you how to create surveys on wordpress if you are looking to create a survey on your wordpress post or wordpress page you're on the right page so we're logged in on wordpress the first thing you need to do is go over to plugins plugins add new plugin so let's create add new i already added but i just want to show you how to edit so it's called poll you will type on search poll on the search bar poll then pull up so there are a lot of plugins but i decided to go with this one over here with this one poll survey and quizzes and makeup plugin so this one you're going to use it this one so you click on install like this then once it's installed you click on activate it will be activated once it's activated then you will see on this side on opinion stage which is this opinion stage the plugin then you go onto opinion stage and click there then you create an account you create an account click on create account you can see it's trusted by a lot of customers okay so it's redirecting me to my account so you just click on create account then you click on create once you're done creating account easy to create account just to add your email then all of the stars then after you created your account it will take you here then where you can choose to create a survey or a poll or a quiz or a personality quiz you can use to create with templates let's try with a template so here's a template you have the template you have the template yes here the template is loading over here okay so let's click on use this template okay then the cover it's a product feedback survey okay so you can just add it on your own then maybe you put your title what the survey is about then this message will pop up when they down help us improve by answering this question or at the first time it will appear then you put your image there the images okay uses this defaulted image okay then here's the answers add question and answers okay how do you rate your our product okay here's it here are the answers five star bad they can tell you okay and you can also add another answer if you want to but they are already had answers or you can customize them according to your survey you are creating okay allow the users to add their own answers too yes i will allow users to add their answers too then there's the submitting button then here's the question too what is the initial impression of our product then it's like it's a rating survey this one it's much more simple then it was the third one allow users to add how long you have been using the product it's like those questions then you change the image you change everything so it's like that so you add image but i will go with this layout it's more than six months or what they choose yes here's the question you are able to customize this question as you want so it is like that the survey let's say we are happy with our surveys and questions and everything and let's click on publish we we'll publish this okay 
answers can't be blank. Okay, this means we must answers. We must answers. We must answers. I think there are answers. Okay, let's add answers. I wanna just wanna add uh good just wanna add good okay we added good error answer to that is just a template that's just wanna add real or something it's like just a test okay so let's see if we can go okay guys this one is taking me a time so I just want to create it from scratch it want me to add answers in everything so I'll just go with this from because it will take time for you guys who are watching while we're adding answers. Let's just click on surveys on top of create new. Then we'll create a new survey from stretch. We'll create a new survey from stretch. So we want to call this survey. How is our shopping? How was your shopping? How? was your shopping maybe let's say i have a shop a sh online shopping then after a shopping i want them to rate us to give us a response how is that with our shopping please help us yeah just please help us to maybe please help us to what Maybe it will help us to get more recommended. Then you click on the image icon. Then you click on your click on the image icon. Then when here yeah, you click on my files, go to over my files. Then browse a file. Browse a file on desktop. Then let me say this uh my shopping logo or anything. Or let me look it from here. Let me say this is my shopping logo. This one. Or whatever logo or something you wanna put it's fine it's up to you guys then let me crop like this you will crop it I think it's fine yes it's fine it's there it's fine then the start button here yeah? start Show them to start a survey. Then let me ask: uh, Did you get your product in expected time? Did you get your product in expected time? Okay, let me just put a question mark then answer one should be no and answer two should be yes answer two no maybe didn't get the product in expected time okay allow users to use then lay you can continue by closing title add more questions yeah you can continue to add more questions multiple choice or you can allow what's right okay add more questions thanks I'm just gonna say thanks once they done closing once they done submitting the survey thanks and pleasure they should see this once they dance. No, I don't need the 
كل اوجا بروتين اوكي I don't want many repeat uh, participation to repeat over and over. Okay, this one it wants me to go to premium. I don't want to go to premium. I'll leave like this. It made new submissions. Okay, now I'm done. I'm happy. Uh, my questions. Let me publish. Moment of truth. Hopefully it works. Yes. Boop. Congratulations. Your survey has been created successfully. Okay. Our survey has been created successfully, so let's go over to yet yeah. and let me refresh so that I will see this survey. Let me refresh. Yes, how was your shopping? Yes, there. So now let me say you want to add this on your post, then click on post, add new post, create a new post. Then we will call it how was your survey to how was your survey i mean how was your shopping what i mean now we're creating a survey uh, not yes how was your shopping and put a question mark then add the little then add on this add icon then add it then type on search poll Paul, yes, this opinion stage poll, then select your poll. No, man, should be here, yeah. should be somewhere here. Yeah. It should be somewhere here. Yeah. I don't know why. Should be somewhere here, yeah, guys, should be somewhere here. Yeah. Oh, survey. Okay. Yo, where are we going on to polls? Once you tap on polls, then we must go to poll here. Yeah? Then there's a drop down. Then we go to survey because we're not looking for poll. Poll is like voting. We're not creating a voting a post. We're creating a, a survey post. So we click here on survey. Here's there. How is shopping? Then you click on insect. So yes, in, insected. Then let's publish. Let's publish. Let's publish. Let's view on a real post so that you can see if it's working. Okay. So, yes. Please help. Okay. How was the survey? Please help us. It will be looking like this. Then you, you should click on start. When the start, then the question will pop up there. Did you get your product in expected time? I forget to add product. Did you get your product in expected time? Answer it should be yes. Then submit yes. I got it in your expected time. Thanks, pleasure. Then that's it. Then you will receive this on your. That's it. It's totally working, guys. Then you will receive this the feedback. You will receive the feedback on your business email that you're using for your website. You will receive the feedback from people who were on your survey. Then you will receive the feedback that, okay, they were happy or whatever the survey is about. You will receive the response, the answers from them on your business email, the one you're using on your website. So, yeah, guys, that's it pretty much simple to create a web i mean it's pretty much simple to create a survey on wordpress so that's it guys thanks for watching make sure you like you subscribe you leave a comment down below